guys, welcome back and thanks for taking the time to join me. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you a, a wee soldier polymer pattern now. I'm going to tell you a wee uh, gold tag version of it. I'm telling a couple of versions here that night for a guy. Now, that's the, the gold tag version. And that's the wee pretty wee bit of flash version for him. So I'm just tying these up so I just thought I would film it. Now the hook in the vise is a Camazon B175 and size 8. Uh, this gentleman likes them big and bushy. The thread we're going to use is the Uni thread NATO in red. So we'll just come in and get our thread started behind the eye of the hook. I'm just going to run my thread down until I'm sort of way in line or just slightly before the barb of the hook and remove the, the waist tag. Now the tail, just red wool. So just offering this up over the back. Come around with a pinch and loop. Take three or four turns going down the, the shank of the hook to tie in the tail. Come in and trim away the excess. Trim this away around about the, the length of the body. The tag, this is a uni mailer, silver and gold. So I'll just offer this up, put this into length, and just hand this in with the, the silver shade facing the south. Run our thread up a bit, a couple of mil anyway, and then we'll just come round with our gold tinsel. And just look on one turn, overlapping the other, to create the tag. Then we'll tie that off, nice tight turns. And trim away the excess. The rib is a oval gold tinsel. This is an oval gold tinsel in size 14. Now, the body itself is red wood. I'm just going to use a, a single ply. Now, what happens is your red wood comes in three ply. Now, I've taken one out of this, but all you do is just hold, hold your wood fairly tight and just pull the the single ply out or if you like you make your body a bit thicker and have a, a two ply body. Right, just going to catch that in and just try and keep the body fairly smooth as you can. Don't worry if the wheel twists around on you, just try and keep it nice and smooth up to there. Right, we'll just take away this wee tag end and we'll just open our wood out and we'll run this up the up the body nice and tight great fly the soldier palmer dead easy to tie as well here so we'll just come in Trim away our excess of wool. Now the body haggle. This is just a, a red game saddle. I'm going to give one of the, the bigger feathers, like I say. He wants them nice and bushy. So I'll just offer that up to the hook here. Nice tight turns to catch in your haggle. I'm going to trim away the stem and then we'll just palmer this down the, the body getting two turns going to the shoulder of the fly and then three four turns down the body so we're going to put another haggle at the front keep it a hold of your tip follow this around with your oval gold pencil and you're looking four turns up the body of the oval gold sweep everything back Bring your oval gold tinsel up in front, following that around with your thread. Nice tight turns to tie that off. Trim away your oval gold. Trim away the tip of the haggle at the back. Sweep everything back. And bring our thread back up into position. Now, we're up on ground. 
next tackle, same cape, only only saddle capes. You get these They're smaller feathers at the bottom, and they're ideal for flies like this. The the traditional block or still water flies. So we're just going to stroke back the fibers just to reveal the tip. Just trying to create it like a wee Christmas tree type shape, just to give you room to tie the tip in. Offer this up to the hook, around with two turns, that's your tip caught in. Fold the tip of the haggle back, bring your thread back up over the tip and the haggle. Then bring away your tip. Now you can come in with your scissors and rub it up the stem if you wish, or you can just use your fingers to stroke the, the fibres of the haggle back. I'm going to put three turns at the front here of the, the hackle, so one more is going to do it. It's nice and bushy now, not overdressed, bushy. A couple of tight turns, fold the stem of the hackle back, put a balance and braces here. And then fold up your head. Your thread tight and bring away the stem of the haggle. Go straight in with your work finishing tool. Any favours you want to go for, just hold them back. Do you want to work finish? Then trim away your tan thread. That's the way you fly. Now, we'll just come in and put on. And we coat a super glue first onto the head. Now you gotta seal your super glue up. So after the super glue, I'll come in and put on a couple of coats of varnish. Just to seal up the head. There you go. That's just a, a gold tag. Soldier Palmer. Now can't beat the, the soldier palmer, like I say. Great fly. To have in your box. So look guys, hopefully it's got something out of that. Tie a few of those up, hopefully, then catch you a few fish. As always, many thanks for taking the time to view the video. I really appreciate it, thank you. If you like the wee videos that I'm putting together and maybe you still haven't already subscribed to the channel, please think about subscribing. It helps the wee channel grow. And until the next time guys, please stay safe and tight lanes folks.